Some executives are calling on the United Auto Workers Union to end the strike. Ford Motor Company Executive Chairman Bill Ford says company's entire future is at the stake if the strike continues. Ford says that the strike at the Kentucky truck plant has forced it to lay off more than 500 workers in its own company and harming tens of thousands of parts suppliers. During a conference call last week, a top Ford executive said the car makers had reached the limit in how much the company could offer in wage increases. The UAW says Ford's offer is a 23% increase over four years. And union leaders say that they'll strike for as long as they need to to get what they think is fair. Wave News reporter David Mattingly finds local union leadership unreceptive to Ford's comments. John, Bill Ford's public comments to the UAW are a big change from what we've seen so far in these behind-the-scenes negotiations. And workers here were listening, but it may not be the reaction that Ford was looking for. In its six-day, picket lines at Ford's Kentucky truck plant show no signs of change. Picketers at every entrance are greeted with supportive car horns from drivers passing by. And in spite of an extraordinary appeal by the head of the Ford Motor Company himself, this strike for a new contract appears at an impasse. The ball's in his court. Uh, he can end it as fast as he wants to end it. Uh, we're just looking for a fair contract, and we're going to be out here until we get one. We need to come together to bring an end to this acrimonious round of talks. In a surprising video statement, Ford Executive Chairman Bill Ford made an appeal for unity. Breaking the silence of big three automakers' top executives, Ford spoke directly to UAW leadership, warning of economic consequences after shutting down the Kentucky truck plant. Shutting down that plant harms tens of thousands of Americans right away. Workers, suppliers, and dealers alike. Ford also tried to turn attention to the company's competition with non-union automakers, saying the challenge is not about Ford versus UAW. Local union leadership was unmoved. If you don't think for a minute that Ford Motor Company has a specific strategy to manipulate or navigate for a solution or outcome that they want, then you'd almost be a fool. Ford said the company's non-union competitors are loving this strike, and he told strikers here they will win and all of us will lose. Reporting live, David Mattingly, Wave News. Thanks, David.